Oh, you're your chocolate. Yes. Can I stand up? Okay. Hi. Um, so first off, this is for her. If you want this on, if you're allowed to, but this is for her. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll leave you up there. Trust me. Okay. So first off, y'all are amazing. We love you so much, and we love your characters. But my question is for both of you. Um, so if Supernatural was able to have about two or three more episodes, what do you think they would be about based on the series finale of Both Y'all in Heaven? Well, I think uh, I think maybe Supernatural should have two or three more episodes. <laughs> That's a good question. Or 10. Or 327. Or 327. Or 327. Uh, why not? Uh, that's a great question. Uh, I, I think in, in my head, once the boys kind of re met, we've all seen the finale. Yes? Yeah. I don't want to ruin anything. Uh, but I think once the boys connect on the bridge, they, they go for a drive and they probably find that beach they've been for for a long time. Um, and just sit back and think about it. Remember when you asked if we could stop it? All the evil in the world. Yeah. If we could really change things. Well, maybe with Jack we can. Maybe you're right. <laughs> but then what will we do? Hmm. <laughs> Yeah. This. A whole lot of this. But on a beach somewhere, you know? I see like a like a montage of Dean just acting out. Like, <laughs> like Sam just like, slow down! Or like donuts in the parking lot and Dean's like, we're in heaven, dude. We're in heaven, man. I can do whatever I want. Like way too like music is like blowing speakers uh driving is super fast um you know just all of that i don't know there there, there, there should have been like an entire episode devoted to what these guys are now doing in heaven um, and sam gets like an entirely new mental letters library with entirely new books and he's still like i need to read more <laughs> well, he's just doing Donut. Sam's Around putting there. Sam's putting like the final touches on like a model big like battleship, and he just like he just like hangs the very like the top thing, and then Dean just comes in and just kicks it off. <laughs> and he's like, ah, ah, ah. I don't know, something like that. Do you imagine you, me, Cass, toes in the sand, a couple of them little umbrella drinks, matching Hawaiian shirts, obviously, some hula girls. You talking about retiring? You? If I knew the world was safe, hell yeah. And you know why? Because we freaking earned it, man. Drink to that. Yeah. Hell yeah. Or, do you know the story about one time we, we, we were shooting the Apollo and I was driving, and then it was like, Father feet back to uh, trailers for lunch, and so in this big old gravel parking lot, and he was like, "You know what? I think I'm gonna do some donuts." And so sure enough, he starts doing some. We drive back to our trailers, and he starts doing some donuts. And randomly, we start seeing people like, "No, like diving for cover." We didn't realize that they were. I was spitting rocks, <laughs> and I was shooting them a good like, you know. They were go they were going for like fifty yards. Yeah. I was just peppering the the base camp. <laughs> Uh, thank you. I'm gonna go. Oh, good times. My name is Dean Winchester. I'm an Aquarius. I enjoy sunsets, long walks on the beach, and frisky women. And I did not kill anyone. Dean's always gonna be there. And I was sharing earlier, like, I, I, I didn't, I didn't really mourn, I haven't mourned the show. I haven't mourned Dean being gone. I, I, I haven't because it's, it's not. He's not. I mean, here we are 20 or a year later after the show has ended, and we're all here to talk about the show. And so I think it's, uh, I, I think it's going to be around uh, for a long, long time in some capacity. And who knows, maybe even, maybe we even like do one of those reunion things and uh, come back or, or do a movie or I don't know. Maybe we just take like three years off and come back and start all over again. I, I don't know.
Yeah, anyway, thank you. Mm -hmm. How are you still like this? Not everything we did was because of Chuck. The blood, the sweat, the tears, man. That's us. What happened to Butch and Sundance? What happened to going out sweet? Yeah, I, uh, I, I've said for a while that um, I'd love to see those boys again, you know? Um, and we're in a crazy world with different things going on, and um, I, I do have a few ideas of how they could come back, and I think a, a few other people have a few ideas, and maybe some of them link up, and maybe there's a studio or a network or a, a streamer or a movie house or whatever that would be interested in telling the story. Um, but yeah, I hope we see Sam again. I, I think I know. I think after however long it's been since I well September tenth, twenty nineteen, um, that I said bye to Sam and that said bye to Dean. You know, Jensen and I have grown a lot. Um, we both got to go other places and be with our family more and be with ourselves more. And so I think the Dean that he could be and the Sam that I could be now or sometime in the future um, would be even better than the last one we saw. And, I, and we wouldn't just be crying all day long. <laughs> It'd be a nice reunion. And I'd love to see a lot of the characters back. Um, so, yeah, fingers crossed. I'd love to do it. Well, I think we we I think we caught a glimpse of what Dean does in heaven. I think he he drives around a baby and and he pops tops on the on the front porch of Harvell's and he probably goes over to to mom and dad's and and gets some lasagna and then he, he goes to drive and you know he's I think he's just trying to live his best life. I think at a certain point he's uh, he's gonna miss the life and he's probably gonna probably get with Sam and uh, uh, tell Jack hey. Put us in, coach, and that's that's the Netflix uh, or the Amazon or the Apple or the uh, uh, whatever streaming uh, Hulu type of subscription you uh, subscribe to. That's the reboot. Or maybe we just like grab a few GoPros and get in the Impalas and roll camera, <laughs> and then, and then just sell it to everybody. Hey, I know a production company that would actually do that. Can we call them? Do you know their number? I, I have their number. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Bye, boys. No, it's been, it's been, and frankly, and this is obviously on camera, so maybe I shouldn't say this. I feel like the show could go 15 more, honestly. Like, I feel like we have so much that we could do, so many stories we could tell. I mean, we're 15 years in, it's just the show that will never end. Since since it was determined that the show was going to end at 327 episodes, um, I'd like to think of this as a see you later, not as a goodbye. Um, so. No doubt, endings are hard. But then again, Nothing ever really ends, does it? We won't be gone long, I promise. It came to the point of like, okay, I think this is the right time. Like, I, it was a, it's a weird decision. And then I'm gonna sell them out. <laughs> when Jensen got to Vancouver two weeks ago, I have a text message from him. He's like, man, crazy to be back in Vancouver. I feel like we could do two more years. And I was like. <laughs> Let's talk, man. Like, I <laughs> to all the Espion family out there, thank you so much for uh, taking this journey with us for 15 years. Uh, we love you, and we won't be gone long, I promise. Thanks for watching Wayward Winchester. Subscribe for more awesome Wayward content. Till next time, as always, no chick flick moments. Peace.